Welcome back to the channel everybody. In today's video I am going to try to replace this drying motor um, on my forecast uh, power wrapper. I'm going to use this CRB motor I have here. I just did the first part of my Tiger Stripe uh, um, rod wrap in I, the video previously and uh it's just a pain in the butt to do a wrap in this wrapper and then take it out and put it in the crb dryer to dry it when i it's just a, a nightmare to keep switching things back and out it's been out for a long time so and today i'm gonna take this motor and put it over into the power wrapper the power wrapper motor is uh 30 rpm so and this thing's like 15 or something like that it's really slow compared to the other one but it'll do it a pinch i'll fast forward a little of this it's just a simple video so i can finish my rod wrap and get you guys part two of the tiger stripe video that we just previously did so let's get into this we'll fast forward a little bit of it we don't want to make the video too long everybody gets annoyed so we'll just yank this apart put it in there and uh get this underway
so we got the motor in and uh, plug it in here and we'll give her a try before we mount everything huh it's not working I know I wired it right and the motor worked in the CRB wrapping stand so something has to be the matter here let me look at this here on tape this make sure nothing came loose but uh, I don't see why this thing won't turn it, if I should turn the power off but let's see what happens here Plug it because I know I'm gonna get zapped here. Now let's take this tape off before I, uh, I just don't understand. It was working fine, so oh, there we go. It's a bad termination on the switch. The wire was frayed, and it looked like only the insulation was holding it. This ain't no problem. We'll just strip it and uh, wrap it around the screw and tighten it back up and I'm sure it'll work then.
put these screws in here and we might have to align this uh, wheel because you got to take this uh, the, old, the big uh, belt off and move it from pulley to pulley so we want them aligned I don't want to wear out the belt I did this forecast did come with a spare belt I've got a lot of miles on this first one but we'll see let's test her out here and uh, see what happens look down at it does look like it's off just a little let's uh let's adjust this to get her right where we want it i think that'll do right there we go that looks much better tighten this thing up and we'll fire it up and uh, that'll be a wrap thanks for watching everybody um i should probably should make sure it works but subscribe to the channel like the video leave a comment and uh, we'll get part two for you uh probably need to plug it in first that would help but uh the tiger strike video part two is coming it works it's live let me get some epoxy on this so it can dry and i can get you that second part of the video thanks for watching everybody